What's up YouTube, it's your boy Freddy Rods. Today's video, we got a special bike. We have my brother's Grom clone that he converted to 190. Beautiful there. And we're gonna do, what are we doing? 212. We're doing a 212. 212 big bore on a 190. We have it all here in the, in the box. Let's see what we got. All right, so we just opened the box. We're gonna do pretty much a big bore conversion on it. So he's doing a <clears throat> 212 um, CC with a cylinder, well, a new cylinder and piston, um, 66 millimeter. And then he's using a four valve instead of a two valve that it goes into the, you know, 190 there. Um, so looking at this, tbparts.com, we have the cylinder, we have the head, I'm guessing this is a piston and piston rings, you brought oil and exhaust gaskets and all that, so yeah. How do you feel about this? I'm excited. Yeah? <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, this is, this is gonna be, <laughs> it's, gonna be it's, 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 it's pretty much 9 a.m. I told them I'm coming early because Knowing these bikes, um, we're gonna be here all day. So yeah, let's uh, take you guys through the process. Uh, I've never done this, he's never done this. Um, I've done, we've done it on the regular Grom, Grom clones. So we've, we've, done, we've done the 141 on it, you know, on, a, on that engine, but we've never done it on this level for the Daytona. So stay tuned with us. I'll try to get as much as I can through the process um, while scratching our heads, because I'm pretty sure we got. So, um, let, yeah, let, let's show you real quick what, what is it that we, we got. Look at these jams. There goes the four, four valves with a cam and everything inside. Everything's already inside. Like, look, it, came, it comes with a, with a spark plug. Turn it around. We have the valves and everything are in there. And the cam is in here. Yeah, I see, it. I see the cam already in there. Wow, <laughs> this is gonna, you're gonna do, you're gonna be highway. You're gonna be on the highway on this, B. Look, oh, yeah, nice. So, so from a black, from a, coming from a black engine, you know, cause he wanted to get the black, he did some custom paint work, but now he'll, he'll have the two-tone cause it'll look cool cause it has the front cover is black, but then the head is um, that the silver and it's gonna look good. Oh, look at that. EEA beautiful. Man. And we got the piston. Brand new for that piston, baby. So if we get this done, don't worry, turbo setup's coming. <laughs> what? A turbo <laughs> setup? Insane, right? No. <laughs> All right, no, no, that draw the line there. We'll just leave it in. Yeah, no, 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 no. no. <laughs> this, is, this is too much money for a little last bike. Look at the. What is that? Hmm? That's the cam tensioner. Cam tensioner. Oh, cool, okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, let's let's get the process started. <laughs> all right, first things first, we gotta take all our side. side covers, everything, because you know, even though we're working down here, all this is in the way. So, taking all that. A, a doozy so yeah so that's what we're doing we're taking them fa the, the main four um, there's some some extra allen ones that holds the jug on in there so we gotta take these two off all right so we just took um, the head out so head out four of those bolts the longer ones come in this side shorter on this side um, had to take the cam cam off we also took the, 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 the cam sprocket off, the chain was able to do it. So now we have the tensioner right here for this and we gotta take, which it should be a slide in. Um, got 
hide it? Yeah. There you go. So now we have this. I'm gonna hold the chain. Oh, it's coming everywhere. And we good. You good? Good. It's good. Uh huh. We good, we good, we good. Life is good. There we go. Woo! Those chain guides. I think one goes there, the other one stays in the engine. Yeah. So. Woo! All right, piston off um, for six months worth of riding. That shit is beautiful. That shit was firing. There's no scoring, there's nothing. Let me see the jug. It's fucking clean. It's fucking scratches, beautiful. No. So, I mean, the, the the engine itself came is he didn't do any actual work. Um, it was sh drop shift to the house and he just put it on other than, you know, taking this off and painting it. Um, that's it. So now we got to take the piston off, put a new piston, um, put the new piston on. And then, yeah. So same thing we're doing um, for those that don't know. Um, when you're putting a piston on, usually, you know, when I do it, you want to, you want to look at what the other one had because right here, right? Look at the rings. You have the oil ring, you know, um, on the bottom, then you have the, the light white ring in there and the dark ring, the dark ring in the, on the top. So we got to do the same thing, um, when putting, you know, putting these on back in the jug. So, yeah. And then these opening, you do them all kind of triangular. So you do the, t the first opening on the top, second one on a the, on the corner, and the other one there. So whenever you, it closes out in the, in the cylinder, the gaps, you know, the, they're, they're far, far apart. So, all right. So now back to the other side and let's get the other symbol and go. So we were able to put the jug in, the slides are in, everything is good. Uh, it's a top dead center. That's why you see the piston there. Um, I caught this now. Um, he's, Anthony is preparing the race head there, or the head. Um, and then we should be good to go. Um, these, if you don't have these to do valve checks um, between these, um, and you get yourself the, uh, the you know, the, the feeler gauges. Um, I have different ones for these. Um, these are a good tool to have, checking valves and all that. So we just did that. Um, now we gotta put the cover back on, put the cam tensioner back on in here, the, uh, the car back on, all the sensors, the exhaust back on, and let's see how it goes. So. All right, three hours later now. So three hours so far. And uh, we got it all buttoned back up. Everything is on. Carb, we just put the carb on. He's doing the spark plug. Um, now we gonna turn it over to see, make sure everything else in click and clack. And then we get, uh, we get, uh, fire it up. Celebrate. Hopefully it's good. All right, battery's on. Key is on. Kill switch is off. Kill switch is on. Oh, so on? Can, okay, so whatever. Yeah, yeah. Um, oh, oh, on. So quick, yeah, yeah. So we're doing, we're doing a test um, without spark. 
first. So it could, you know, it, it could crank, rotate, rotate uh, throw oil when it needs to oil. Uh, we did put a bunch of uh, assembly lube on it to, to, um, to do it, but it should be good. So now he's going to crank and see. Here we go. First, Buddha. There's some clanking. Some clanking. I'll have to check the valve clearance on it again. I did the micro adjustments. And she fires. Yeah, so now, now we just gotta tie everything back on. We did the measurements, like we have, once again, the valve measurements with this. Um, yeah, we're just gonna now torque everything to spec, everything good, good, good. And we'll do the first ride and, and see how it goes. Nice. Let's go. First impressions. <laughs> you're like this, like you're trying to feed him. <laughs> what's, your, what's your first impression? You guys like the ratchet? <laughs> <laughs> it's the strap chip. <laughs> first reaction is definitely more snappy. The uh, throttle is right there when you want it. Uh, it does need some. It needs some fine tuning on the carburetor itself, but rather than that, it starts up, shoots up real good. Top end is ridiculous. Ridiculous. You heard it, you heard it. He wrote it, That's, that was it. So I think uh, that concludes today's video. Yeah, we put it on, we fire it up, it runs. Uh, first time doing one like that, so yeah. Definitely a learning experience. Definitely a learning experience. If so. you are not mechanically inclined, take it to a shop. <laughs> to somebody who knows what they're doing, because you'll be lost, you'll mess up some parts, and it'll be game over for you. What he said, what he said. So take, take. It'll be game over. Yeah, be game over if you don't know what you're doing because piston will knock and yeah you don't want that so yeah till next time it's your boy freddy rods and ronan later